Hello ladies and gentlemen, again this is Pringles or Ethan and today we are doing a mod, a quick little review on uh, Sounds of Skyrim for the dungeons and I'll try to get the wilds, uh, yeah, so that's about it today. Um, I'm not going to be talking much, but afterwards, after the clips I'll tell you what I think about it and how it affects the mood or, yeah, the mood of like... Uh, Skyrim after you install it. So I'll see you after this. Also, just a little side note, uh, I guess I could do another mod, um, this one is Unconjurable Ethereal, Ethereal Horse, and it's actually really helpful if you don't want to, like, spend the money to get a horse. Actually, it's 5,000 gold when you have to buy it, but it's kind of weird seeing the Lich King ride around on this thing. But, uh, I'll put the mod author of this in the description as well, I really like this mod. But yeah, all these sounds that you're like that you're hearing outside that don't sound like wow, that don't sound like uh, natural Skyrim sounds. It's all part of the Skyrim Sounds of the Wild mod, which I really like, and it really adds realism, and it's completely lore friendly. All right, now we're gonna look at the um, the dungeons part of the sounds mod. So yeah guys, that's about it for this mod, um, I'll put both the authors for the horse mod and the Sounds of Skyrim mod in the description. Thank you very much for watching, if you liked it, give it a like and a favorite, maybe uh, subscribe please, and thanks again guys.